pixie dream glow moment because I have this urge to just reorganize my entire place tonight. And we're gonna do it because I need some organization in my life right now. Everything just feels so chaotic. So recently, I've just. So recently, I've just. Woo! I've just been feeling so chaotic. There's so many clothes at home. The things just keep piling up, you know? Once you start, like, being an adult and collecting things over time, like, have this intense mess and chaos at home, and it just becomes impossible for you to live cohesively. So, in order to combat that, I don't know why I talk like I'm a science professor. <gasps> so chaotic. I love it. I love the vibe. But we're actually gonna reorganize, or rather, make my bedroom into a recording studio slash closet what I call my bedroom is the room I'm in right now and my living room is outside and then I have the tiniest kitchen ever so my plan is I'm gonna make it into a massive walk-in closet because there's such good natural lighting in here thought it'd be a good idea for me to just move all my clothes in here make it look super cute and aesthetic and then record from inside here so that I actually can separate my personal life from my work life and then we're gonna move the bed outside but it's gonna be a quasi living bedroom situation we are gonna have our manic manic moment today and we're gonna organize it so it's almost evening time it's like almost 5 p.m on a friday so yeah this is this is what i'm doing my friday night you know what enough of me explaining it let's just start on moving things i think that'll be much better i think that's probably better than me explaining it because sometimes i feel like I don't, I don't describe it the right way but yeah let's just get started Let's go, manic, manic moment. Trying to avoid the seasonal depression. This is gonna be so chaotic because I have to bring that entire full size bed out of this door frame. Remember the guys who had got the bed in the first time struggled? There were like four of them carrying it, and now I'm gonna do it alone. Strong girl moments. So those gym games are really gonna be tested tonight. <laughs> Why am I doing this to myself? <laughs> Because of the amount of space it takes up, I'm actually not sure whether or not it's a good idea to put it out here. But you know what? We're going to be moving all the clothes anyway to the inside. So maybe it will work out. <laughs> it's just chaos up in here. I mean, look at all this free space and the natural lighting coming in. This is crazy because I can actually use the space more often. I never used to use it before. Like, to be honest, other than to sleep, I was never really in my bedroom half the time. So, and to record, but I recorded in this corner. This sad little corner over here that doesn't get much lighting because it's literally not, doesn't even have direct lighting. It just faces a wall. So much better already. <laughs> I'm gonna figure things out slowly. At least the room looks cute now and it's still super gloomy. I think that usually messes with my head a lot, but we are getting somewhere. I'll give you a little update later. <laughs> I wanna record everything, but at the same time, I'm just like, I'm so scared of knocking this camera over. So I have to be careful. Just a little bit, just a little bit. This is going swimmingly. You literally can't even see me. It's just, ugh. Gloomy days in New York just don't have my heart. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It just doesn't. Okay, the little studio is coming together. Sorry if you hear some background sound. I'm playing Family Guy. I love binging TV shows as I clean. So coming together, we got the little shoe rack in here. I got my dress rack, which I'm probably gonna change because I have to put some up for sale. I changed where the poster is. Little bookshelf is there. And I'm actually gonna move this table outside and a big bookshelf cubicle thing is gonna come there and I'm gonna organize all my clothes on that. So it's all coming together. almost done with the room i have this last thing to set up for all the clothes on the floor there so we're almost good to go by the end of today but okay funny story i had a really poopy morning and when i say poopy i literally mean poopy because my toilet just 
broke. I don't know what happened. I woke up in the morning. I went to take my little morning tinkle. Like, tinkle, 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 tinkle totally doing my normal everyday thing. And then I flushed once and then it just wouldn't stop leaking. It can't use my own toilet. Thank you. Thank you, New York. Mm -hmm. Let's get to building this so then we can enjoy the room and I can give you a little tour. Of struggle and I got my bathroom fixed I got the toilet fixed so I am ecstatic right now because I can finally take a pee in my own toilet <laughs> it was really bad this morning I ran over to my boyfriend's place to take a little number two and his roommates opened the door and one of them was just like what are you doing here because he hasn't been in town for a while and I was just like I didn't know how to respond to that here because for the vibes, for the vibes. I literally had to run over and I was holding my pants just like, oh my God, just like, please don't come up now. But he came and fixed it and I'm so happy because I can finally use my own toilet and I've been chilling at home because fall has been falling and it's been so pretty and windy outside and I've just been enjoying the view. Like, let me show you. So, so pretty. So now we're at home in our cozy. The room is finally ready. I spent the morning recording and cleaning up. It's finally looking really pretty in here. Let me show you some of the details. So this is the little entryway. We have these bags up on the wall here. We have this little bookshelf where I used to store ribbons, some of my bags, some random accessories and decorations, my books, my little diploma, whatever these other things are, a magazine and bag. It's just more random stuff. This basket is for all my new packages that come in that I want to record with or new clothes that I get so that I don't forget that I got them. It's a really toxic trait of mine. I always forget that I have new clothing when I get it. Here is my little fall time rack. I always like to update this rack with new things that come in or different pieces that inspire me so that I can be wearing them and I don't have to dig inside this closet to find it. So it's all up here. And then I have my little shoes over there. Super cute, just random shoes to fit the vibe of the rack. My little Audrey poster is up there. I also have this random camera stand for some reason. I just forgot to put it back. And then Moving on, this was what I had been waiting for this entire time and was the reason I couldn't record this before I left on vacation and that was like a week ago. I finally got this shelf organizer thing. I think it's a bookshelf. It's like a random organizer place in your home but I decided I can make it like a little wardrobe organizer. So I have my tops up here, some mini skirts, a lot of my jeans right now here. And then just like random sections. Like honestly, I will say that I started off organizing the clothes according to different categories, but I kind of don't remember what they were. So now we just have clothes in random shelves. This unfortunately not very pretty. I just kind of chuck all of my random head accessories and random accessories in here. Like I have a little bag here. Honestly, I don't know what half of these decorations are, but I just want to make it look pretty. And then here I have all my shoes. I put all my heels up on this, some of my boots down here. Honestly, I want to get one more of these, but a little bigger so I can put some of my boots up here and clear out some more space. But for now, this looks pretty cute. Like, it's easy to access most of my boots here, so I don't mind it. And then I got this little fake potted plant thing just to decorate the mirror area a bit because I love taking my little fit checks and selfies in this mirror. I have my little kitty frame here because I didn't know where else to put it. My little, what do you call this, uh, shoe rack or organizer thing here. I didn't know what to do with it. I didn't want to take it apart because I already spent the money on it and honestly, it just makes sense to store a lot of the shoes that I don't really wear a lot in here so I can save space. I also use it to hang some of my belts so it kind of comes in handy a lot. And then I have my little closet here but it doesn't fit a lot of clothing so what I've done, put all my dresses and long tops and sweaters and jackets up here. I put my Indian clothes up there, my more traditional wear up there that I'm saving for like different occasions. I don't know. There's nothing else really up here those are some old clothes from when i was in high school so i don't know why i have them but i hate letting go of clothes so i'm hanging on to those stubbornly down here i have this little box with all my summer clothes and stuff that i'm selling on depop so it just like you know doesn't get in the way of everything and i can actually keep this place clean i have some of my other summer clothes in here all my baby tees that i don't really wear at the moment up there some bags some towels because honestly i didn't know where else to put the towels so finally this bag rack is just so off kilter 
There are literally too many bags on it and I don't know what to do at this point, but you know what? It's okay because bags are gonna bag and I don't have any space for it, so I'm gonna leave it there. Even though it literally falls on top of me every time I knock it over even a little bit, so it's okay. It's okay. I don't know where else to put the bags and I don't want to put them in the living room. And now moving on to my little living area. Sorry about the bed. It's a little bit of a mess. I was like sitting in bed before this. Why is banana duck out here? So cute. It's just like a banana duck. One of my favorite toys ever. Here's my little pink couch. My little desk where I work. And I have a coat rack out here. I could have put it inside the room, but I kind of want it outside because it just makes more sense when I'm leaving the house to just have them out here so I can just grab them and take them on. And it makes sense because it's also fall time, so they come into use a lot. Wait, wait. I gotta complete the vibe in here. So cute. So, so cute. My little cozy corner. I love it. This is the end of my massive house makeover. I'm really happy with the way it turned out. I have like a really cute studio to work in now. I feel like there's such good lighting in here, especially with like the windows behind. So I am living for this arrangement because I actually feel more comfortable recording now because I make messes whenever I my little outfit changes. I love the fact that I have so much space in here so that even if I make a mess, it doesn't matter. I can clean it up later. That's the end of my massive makeover. And I hope you enjoyed watching. It was definitely very chaotic thanks for watching and i hope you enjoyed joining me on this little makeover session for my house but yeah love y'all so happy with the new house <laughs>